Back at it. January the 26th, 2021. Back with another upset alert. We got the New York Knicks 8 and 10 against the Utah Jazz 12 and 4. Uh, we we came up short yesterday with the Cavs. It was a it was a very uh, interesting game to say the least. The Cavs were down and they came back and they ended up losing. I think they covered, but uh, they didn't pull off the upset. And you know we're gonna keep swinging. I've been on a losing streak. My reads have been off. I'm still waiting on my powers to come online for 2021. So got to keep swinging. You know, got to keep shooting it, shooting that shot until it goes in. And you know, weather the storm. I hate losing. I really hate. It's like I hate losing with a passion. It's hard for me to, you know, make these these uh, videos public for my picks when and. When I lose, it's already, you know, devastating to lose. It's like, I hate losing. And so I feel, I feel you, you know, the fact that you have, you know, liked these picks and thought that maybe they could happen like I did and lost. It's like, you know, I apologize. Uh, you know, I'm try my best to, you know, get back in the winner's circle and, you know, get a new winning streak started. But uh, right now, all I could do is keep trying and, and, you know, have the same effort and increase my effort and focus on winning. And we we have the uh, situation here with the uh, Utah Jazz and the Knicks, and we see the 12-day numerology came up. We see the head-to-head record, 50-51. to The Knicks win their tied their head-to-head record. The jazz coach, Quinn Snyder, is 88 day of age. We see two eights there with his uh, day of age. And they have an eight game winning streak going, so it can end in eight. Uh, they're playing in Utah. This is his coaching record. He has 215 all time losses. Today, you can get 216 on January the 26th. That's strong. Uh, it might not happen. It may win. But, you know, when I see something in here in the record or the numerology, is someone that a team has a higher percentage to get an upset. So I like to go for those type of scenarios. So we'll see how it comes out. But I would say don't put any money on the game. I'm just going to tell people that from now on. So... You know, if they make that decision, it's on them, but I would tell them not to. You see Tom Tildo, it's his ninth day of age, and the Knicks could get their ninth win today. So that's a strong coincidence, uh, strong synchronicity for that to happen. And this would be his 361st win, and 361 has a square root of 19, and 19 has a is the eighth prime number. And, you know, that streak of eight is on the line. So it's a lot there for an upset today. It's a big line. It's over $400 line today on this game. And I would lean towards it happening. But like I said, I wouldn't uh, advise you or recommend you to put any money on this game. It's a high-risk game. Uh, But I do see some things today that are showing me that it can happen. So we'll see. Please leave a comment, like the video, support the channel. We're being censored by ScrewTube. And, you know, when I make a video, it's like you may not even like the video or or anything like that. But it would be good if you would just like it or if you just don't like it. You know, some kind of interaction, a comment. You know, you may have something different. You know, I welcome you to do that to help support this channel. Uh, if you don't like these type videos, I won't make them. Uh, I get to, you know, the main topic for this year that I want to focus on is crypto and credit. And those videos are going to be coming. And I'm going to try to grow the channel and increase the uh, subscribers so we can start having a live chat going where we can really, you know, get down to the gist of these things and 
really get into a, a higher level of communication to where we can interact directly uh, every day if possible. So let me know what you think about this.